All right, Charlotte Basketball Network, we're here at South Mech High School. We're talking to 2023 point guard Anastasia Sinclair. Anastasia, I have to start by asking, where do you get your name from? Well, um, honestly, it was just a name that my parents picked when I was born. Uh, I think my dad put it together, Anastasia, my middle name Celeste. They thought it sounded good together, and that's my name, Anastasia Celeste Sinclair. So is there any connection to the Disney movie Anastasia at all? No, there is not. Although I do love that movie, it's not. There's no connection. Okay. <laughs> Let's talk about Let's talk basketball. About Where did your love for the game really start? Um, I have been playing basketball for as long as I remember. I remember doing rec leagues when I was like four years old and I've just always had like a really deep love for the game that I've just developed over the years and it hasn't gone away since. So I love it. Okay. So that takes me to coming here to South Met. You've been here all four years. You played under Coach Mitchell, now playing under Coach Clark. What does it mean to you to be here four years and finish your career here? Um, honestly, it means the world to me. The school has done so much for me on and off the court. I am beyond grateful for the opportunities that it's awarded me over the years. So just being able to start with this school, end with this school, and show give the commitment that it's given to me for the whole four years has just been amazing. Nice, that's awesome. All right, so let's get down to this season. I had a chance to watch that Myers Park game. You really were incredible down the stretch. I believe you had like six points in about 20 seconds. What did it mean for you to, to, to do that and get this victory for this program? It really was like a, a game of highs and lows. And I just think at that point, it was just the momentum. I felt like we needed the momentum to shift in our direction since we were down. And I just, I decided to take control of the court. Like as a point guard, I feel it's my job to get my team under the control and get my team in situations where we will perform the best, at, perform the best, and in the end, come out with the victory. Now, talk about your unselfishness because you're a very unselfish player. But I saw how you decided not to pass the ball. You just kind of took over the game. Is that something that you work on a lot? Um, I think. Being a leader on a lot of the teams that I've been with over the years, my coaches have really enforced me of being like, being in control of the court and making sure to put my teammates in the best positions where they can score, but also knowing when I need to get mine and when I need to take control of the ball. All right, so looking at your numbers, your top five in the conference in scoring, you lead the conference in both steals and assists. So you really become just an all around talented player. Who do you attribute that to? Well, I've had many, many coaches over the years, but definitely Coach Adrian Calhoun, my most recent AU coach. He coached me for Team United last season, and he just, he's really pushed me to be like a great player on the court and just being a good person off the court. And I feel like that also translates over as well, just to, I don't know, just being the best I can be for my team so that my team can be successful. What do you expect this team to accomplish by the time the end of the season comes here? Um, I expect us to be conference champions, conference tournament champions, to make a decent run in state playoffs. I think we have uh, the talent and I think we have the personnel to really take us uh, to where we want to go, which is, you know, hopefully states. But we do think we're going to make a pretty deep run. All right, Anastasia, I wish you the best of luck this year. Thank and you. And hope you have a good end of the season. All right, thank you so much. This has been a presentation of the Charlotte Basketball Network.